I am from Scotland and America, um, and I spend a lot of time in both countries. Um, I really enjoy traveling in general and reading and, and trying to learn new languages. Um, I also really enjoy running. I did my first marathon last year, and I hope to do another one soon. And at the moment, I'm researching, uh, I'm writing a historical fiction novel, and I want to keep doing that. So, yeah. <laughs> I don't want to give too much away, okay. because, um, <laughs> but it's about a female artist in the 19th century in the Regency era and her life. Um, I think what inspired me to apply to the National Opera Studio is because I had quite a few friends who had previously gone here and also who, singers who were coming here this year. and. It seemed like the best thing to do coming out of a conservatoire opera program. I think I'd really been taught like the tools of, of what a, a repetitor's job is, but now to actually really put them into practice and have a lot more refinement um, around developing those skills, it seemed like the best place to come for that. The best thing about being a young artist at the National Opera Studio is the amount of coachings that we get with people who have had wonderful careers and who I really look up to, as well as the residencies. It's been really amazing to see the different opera companies in the UK um, to work with people who are, who are just working in this industry. It makes you really feel like you're one of them. Um, and, yeah, and I think getting to know all the other singers and work as a group throughout the year has been really special. Um, it's, a hard, it's hard to answer whether I feel more American or Scottish because I think it changes where I am. I usually feel a little bit out of place in either country. Uh, so I studied, I did my undergraduate in America and I felt very Scottish then. Um, and then when I came back to Scotland, I felt more American, but I really like having both of those parts of my, of my identity. I was bullied in primary school for bringing peanut butter and jam sandwiches to school. People thought that was disgusting. So. It is. <laughs> <laughs> I think I would envisage having a career in America as well as Europe. Um, I'm doing some work out in Chicago this summer, coaching um, Humperdinck's Hansel and Gretel. So that'll be my first kind of job out there and I really hope to continue working um, all over the United States. Really. Creative, inspiring and supportive. <laughs>